Hello everyone, welcome back to yet another Star Stable video. As always, please be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already. And today, I don't know if this will sound good or not, but I'm not actually using my headset because it's broken out of nowhere. I'm using an actual microphone, so I don't know what the difference will be, but we'll test it out while I hopefully can fix my microphone. Um, decided to be a little sassy, which I don't like. So it's my second time filming this video, but hopefully the second time is the charm. All right, but that is besides the point. Today we are doing best versus worst Shire updated generation three coat color in Star Stable. So without any further ado, let's get into it. Starting off with the worst or the least rated. I just say worst because it sounds more dramatic, you know? It adds a little dramatic spice that we like. So the worst rated Shire was this kind of caramel one and it only had 103 votes in Star Stable. So oh yeah I asked you guys this over on Instagram in case you're curious where I got this from but it is the caramel Shire with a kind of lighter mane and lighter tail and also lighter feet. So it's really cute and it also has a face marking with some light gray kind of um furs. Like I don't know what type of marking that uh, hairs it has light gray hairs on its face which i thought was really cute this one has more of like a base coat color and is more detail oriented if you know what i mean like i don't know there's just more details about it for example if you go up close to it in game you could see a lot more hairs on the horse than you could the others like the black and white one or the seal bay one so in my opinion it is really cute for an up close perspective but from afar it can look a little bit basic. I really do like this one though. I just haven't seen many players in game that actually have it. So let me know your opinions on it down in the comments down below. Now moving on to the second worst Shire in Star Stable. The second worst Shire is... Okay, I was not expecting this. I was... I was not expecting this. I thought this one would be higher up, but the second worst is actually the Seal Bay. Oh my goodness. I thought this one was so good, but apparently less people liked it than I thought I did. I th thought they did grammar. Anyways, but the Seal Bay is only second worst on the list. So it is not everyone's favorite, but it is really cute. And it has kind of a brown undertone to it. And also some pink nose marking and another nose marking right on its nose which is a very very nice but again it is only second worst and it doesn't have that many other details about it so I can see that compared to like the others with cool markings and everything like that so I can see how it ranked here but I just thought personally that it was pretty cute but it is the second worst as a fact now moving on to the third worst I did include the app horse in here in case you're wondering and I accidentally left out the dapple gray. I added that on later, which kind of skews the data. So I'll let you guys think of where the dapple gray stands near the end. I'll tell you what that's about. But the third worst is, drum roll, the black and white Fort Pinto horse. This is on the third worst side of things. So it is not necessarily the best, though it does stand more near the middle compared to all of the seven coat colors that I included in this video. Video. So again, it is not the best, but not the worst. It has some cute gray markings on its feet and also its face. It has white markings as well and a very cute pink little nose. So yes, this one is available for anyone player one and up at Fort Pinta. Well, you can still access it at Steve's, which I do like they added that and I see why you can't access them all from Fort Pinta. So that's very nice. But yeah, let me know what you think of this one in the comments down below. Moving on, we have the third worst, the fourth worst, or also known as the third from best. So this would be the bronze medal, if you get me. All right, so the third from best is the fifth 
one, which is kind of a more orange red undertone chestnut. And it has also, again, super cute gray face markings and leg markings. I feel like a lot of these have stockings other than the one caramel. Or maybe that's why people didn't like it. I don't know. Stockings are really cute on these horses. And on its face, it has gray face markings just all the way up. And on the other side, it has a really cute kind of not, not symmetrical face marking, if you get me. It's not mirrored, which I do like about these horses. Horses. Star Stable stopped mirroring coats a long time ago. And we have a black mane and a black tail, as well as black right above these stockings. So, again, very, very nice. Let me know what you think of it. And um, moving on, we got the second from top. Mwahahaha. The second from top. Yes. Okay. This one surprises me. I did not know people like this one as much as I thought they did. This is just a regular kind of, I don't know what you call this coat color. Let me know down in the comments, but to me, it kind of looks like a bay, I'm guessing, because it is brown, but I'm not sure. It's more of like a base brown, and it also has a pink face marking right on its nose, and its stockings are super cute because they actually have more of like design to them you know they're not just like straight stockings they actually go slant they go up and stuff like that so again very very nice and that is the second best shire coat color next we have the first best shire coat color not including the dapple gray and that is the light gray slightly dappled horse i'm calling it that bestie it works but this one is just a gray horse with very cute dapples on its back and also a pink face marking, which is also not symmetrical, which we love to see on either side of it. And I think, okay, the reason why I love this horse, I didn't get it, but the reason why I personally love it is its pink face marking and also the dapple detail. Those two, I think, really made this horse special and I could see why it's the first one, not gonna lie. I, I see it. It definitely has more of like going on compared to a lot of the other coats. And lastly, this is where messed up so you have to let me know in the comments if you like this horse or not but I asked you guys over on Instagram like 10 minutes ago because I forgot to add this one into the original batch which made things a little more difficult but the dapple gray I had 17 answers for yes I would buy this horse and yes it is my favorite and 28 for no I would not buy this horse it is not my favorite out of all the shires so take of that what you will I can't necessarily rank it but I'm gonna say that so Somewhere in between and because it's my favorite I'm putting it right in between the third from best and the fourth from best I think it fits in there but let me know what you think of it down in the comments and if that's your favorite or not and yeah that was ranking all of the shires from worst to best let me know what you thought of this video in the comments down below and also uh, this mic situation it's a little scandalous if you tell me all right bye bye bestie <laughs>